All right, starting off first with a 1997 Washington quarter that has a 10% curved clip. You can look for uh, clips on all kinds of different coins. Some will be even smaller than this. Some could be a large portion of the coin. This quarter ended up selling for a little over $35. So not really worth having something like this graded, in my opinion, because you're going to spend more than uh, you know you can actually get back out of it. But this next quarter did sell for over $850, and that's because the 1997 D mint mark quarter here has a grade of an MS68, Mint State 68 by the coin grading company PCGS. So keep that in mind. The coins grade and condition will affect the value tremendously. There could be a Mint State 67 out there that's not valuable at all, but a Mint State 68 could be valuable if there's not many of them out there. So $850 for that one. Now here's another example of a clip. This is a triple clip taking place. So you'll see all three of those there. Pretty obvious on the Washington quarter here. This quarter ended up selling for over $100. It is off center as well. Now here is a 1997 Washington quarter design that was struck onto a 10 cent blank planchet. And this coin is graded at a Mint State 66. This quarter ended up selling for around $690. Can't beat that. Now here's a 1997 quarter that sold for over $260. And that's because the Washington quarter design was struck onto a foreign planchet. It only weighs 4.66 grams. This mint error coin sold for, like I say, over $260. Moving right along to a 1997 P mint mark that was struck onto a five cent planchet. So the quarter design struck onto a Jefferson nickel five cent planchet. Uh, this coin ended up selling for over $170 at auction. Now this next coin here is the same as the, you know, one of the first coins that we looked at in this video. Uh, it is the high grade example of a 1997 P mint mark. So it's graded by PCGS at a mint state 67 plus. Even though these quarters are very, very risky to grade because you don't know if you're going to get that mint state 67 or 68 or 67 plus. Uh, you know, you really have to know about coin grading and, you know, study, study, study. Uh, you can look on their websites and compare your coins to other coins on the grading scale and things like that. Uh, but this coin did sell for $3,500 because of that Mint State 67 plus grade. Now here's a 1997 S Mint Mark. This is the proof quarter and it is the non-silver version. So it's going to be the clad proof. It's graded at a perfect grade, 70 Deep Cameo, sold for $155. Now this next coin is also a perfect grade. It is also a proof quarter from 1997, the S Mint Mark. However, this one is the silver version. So this quarter sold for around $170. All right guys, don't forget to subscribe in the middle. Check out the videos to the left of me. And until tomorrow, I'll see you guys in the comment section below. This is Couch Collectibles and this is where I disappear. Thank you.